Jessica Fox a 108 raw time 110.68 with the two second penalty 110 I still think is going to be good enough for a medal it's just a matter of what colour Nelly Bain now from Germany knows this course very very well and the pressure is on now we're going to get a bit of an idea what the athletes have learned from watching Jess Fox's run, what they learned from their run in the semi-finals this morning on this course, where time can be made up, where you can take some risks and maybe pick up some time. So she's well down, as you would expect, on Fox's time at the moment. That is going to be the a regular side, I think. There aren't going to be many split times in the green. Pretty certain of that during this final. Anybody who can go under Fox's split time, well, it'll be something very, very special. Nellie Bain getting a little bit stuck there in uh, gate number eight. Back on track now, though, just arches the back to miss gate 10. Remains clean. Everything is good at this stage for Nellie Bain. Can she post a sub 115? I think that's really what it's going to take to win a medal. A sub 115. Anything outside that, I think, is going to be very difficult to feature in the medals. But it is a final, and funny things do happen in finals. Nelly Bain, what that time of Jess Fox's will do, though, it means that nobody will be able to take a conservative approach. If they want to win gold, they will really need to throw everything at this run this afternoon here in Augsburg. Nelly Bain has remained clean, no touches, but you can just see how fast Fox was, even with a clean run. And what has seemed like not too many problems for Bain, she is more than nine seconds behind Fox's split time. So it gives you an idea of just how quick Jess was rattling down this Augsburg course. Bain now coming down, she has two more gates to go. It's going to be a pretty good time, but in the end, I don't think that's going to challenge for a medal in this caliber field, but at least she can have the satisfaction of posting a clean run, no penalties at all for Nelly Bain. She now just has to sit and wait to see what everybody else brings to the table. We still have a former world champion to come. We have uh, a former Olympic, well, not a former, she still is an Olympic bronze medalist, Andrea Herzog, here on her course. Her course, I think, is more uh, in um, Markleyburg, but she does spend a lot of time training here as well. So.